Welcome back. We are going to start our workout today with the jump rope. Jump rope is a very effective exercise which works on all your body. It's a very good warm up. It focuses on increasing your stamina, strength, and focus. It improves your mind body coordination. It helps you a lot in your martial arts footwork drills. So, let us know how to do it. Take the jump rope and adjust it according to your height, chest up, core engage, elbows closer to the body here near your waist curve basically. So your forearms should face in this direction, not too front, not too back. So hold the jump rope and now slowly lift your legs up and coordinate with the rope. It goes like this. Breathe out. Okay. We are going to do other variations of jump rope. See, jumping jacks. Butt kickers. High knees. Shuffles. Twist. We are going to do squat hold punches. We are going to hold the squat for a few seconds and add punches to it. So how to do it? Go to the sumo squat position, widen your legs, push your glutes back, your toes should face 45 degrees angle, chest up, core engage, fist closed, place it near your waist curve. Keep an imaginary opponent in front of you and try to hit. So we are going to do stomach punches first. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Now we are going to do face punches. See from other angle, going to the sumo squat position. Add face punches. Now we are going to do mountain climbers. Go down into the push up position so that your shoulder and wrist joint is in one place. Go down into the push up position, core engage and now pull your right knee to your chest. See? Breathe out. Increase your speed. We are going to learn double jab cross. Take the position and do one, two, three. 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 See from this angle. One, two, three. 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 Now we are going to learn double jab cross uppercut. Take the stance and start doing. See from this angle. going to learn push kick. Take the stance and do the push kick to the face level. 
keep an imaginary target, feel that you are going to do push kick onto their face. So it goes like this. Take the stance, lift and hit it on the face. See? See from this angle? Do it with the left leg too. See? Keep it back. Now we are going to do ab scrunches. Lay down flatly on the floor. With knees bent, keep your hands and hold your neck. Core engage. Now slowly lift your torso and do the crunch. While going up, breathe out. While coming down, breathe in. So it goes like this. Just go up only with your core weight. Don't Lift your neck. What we are going to do alternate heel touches. Alternate heel touches greatly work on your oblique muscles. So let us know how to do it. Lay down flatly on the floor. With knees bent, keep your hands straight, engage your core, lift your neck away from the floor a little and with your right hand, try to reach your right heel. So, it goes like this. One, two, right, left, breathe out. Make your core tight, 